everybody, we have a new catalog that came out and with that means new collection. So I wanted to show you how to create this look using the Heartbreaker collection. So if you're interested, keep watching. Okay, so let's get started. We're gonna go ahead and prime our face with a glorious face and eye primer. And I'm just gonna put that all over my face and eyes and anywhere that I want my pores to be blurred out. Then I'm gonna use the Mineral Pigment in Sexy. This is one of my favorite shades. I'm gonna go in with a deluxe brush and I'm gonna sweep that all over my lid and not quite going up into the brow bone, but just staying right below. I absolutely love this shade and the next shade I'm going to use is Confident and I'm going to tap that excess off of the crease brush and I'm going to concentrate the color on that outer V and then I'm going to go in with a really light hand and go in to the inner corner but I really want to concentrate that color on that outer V so it has that depth that I want and I love this color it's like a like a black almost with like gold flex in it. It's a really universal color. It looks great on any skin tone. Blondes, brunettes, you name it. It's a gorgeous color. And next I'm going to go in with any fluffy blending brush. This one's from MAC and it has no product on it. I just want to sweep this um, and blend this these colors out and eliminate any harsh lines because I really want that gradient effect with my eyeshadows today. And then I'm going to go in with our Precision Pencil in Perfect. This is our black liner. And I'm not going to do a wing today. I just want to do a really clean, thin line on my upper lash line. And I'm just going to sweep that from inner corner to outer corner. And this part kind of freaks me out to do on camera. But I'm going to um, show you that I'm lining and I'm um, tight lining my upper water line. And it just gives the illusion of longer lashes. Next, I'm going to go in with the smudge brush and with that shade Confident, I'm going to um, just sweep that on the lower lid just to balance the colors out. And then again, I'm going to take Perfect in that lower waterline. And I love Perfect in the waterlines because it does not move all day long and it's really a perfect black color. I'm going to go in with our Touch Press Powder in Chiffon, and I am totally running out of this color. But I'm going to take my powder brush, and I'm going to um, buff this foundation onto my skin. And I love, love, love our Touch Mineral Press Powder. It just sits so smoothly, especially when you have that primer underneath. And then I'm going to go in, I couldn't resist, with our Precision Brow Liner in the color Dark. You can certainly substitute this if you're getting this kit with another precision um, eye pencil in the colors prim or proper. Those are our two browns. Next I'm going to go in with a stiffer upper lip in the shade Sultry. It's a beautiful hue of red, perfect for this upcoming season. I love this color and it dries. Kind of have to give it a little second to dry, but it dries matte. And then I'm going to line my lips with our Precision Lip Pencil in Pompous. Again, this is a perfect, the perfect color to complement Sultry. And then I'm going to apply my Beachfront Bronzer in Malibu using that three method, going from the forehead to the cheek to the jawline. Since I'm not using any blush, I'm really going to use the bronzer to sculpt out my jaw and my cheekbones. And of course, the 3D Fiber Plus Mascara. There's so many application videos out there, the one really main thing that you have to remember with this mascara is gel fiber gel. So you're going to sweep the gel on your lashes and then you're going to place the fibers. And I say place because I want you to be really deliberate and slow placing these fibers on your lashes. And they're going to stick to that transplanting gel that you applied before. And then what you're going to do is seal them back up with the another coat of gel because otherwise you're going to have fallout on your face throughout the day. So gel, fiber gel always with this 3D Fiber Plus and also with the original if you're still using that. And my favorite tip of all time, the blow dryer trick. With any blow dryer, just put it on the warm setting 
and then blow the air straight up. You can hit it with a shot of cold if you want to set it just kind of like a regular blowout. Love this trick. And we're going to go in and do our lower lashes after the blow dryer trick because I want you to have your upper lashes going up and your lower lashes going down. So really remember to do this after you blow dry your lashes upwards. Okay, so this is the finished look. I hope you love it. This is all from the Heartbreaker collection. Head over to the website to see all the new products that launched this season, and I cannot wait for you to get your hands on it to try it yourself. They are all so amazing.